and welcome back to Mind's Eye. Today, I'll be showing you how to assemble the differential. But first, let's take a look at how it works. The differential acts as a final gear reduction, transmitting power from the motor case to the wheels. We have two options for our differential, a traditional and a solid shaft. The traditional differential allows the wheels to spin at different speeds while taking corners. The solid shaft locks both wheels together. Putting together the differential is simple. First, put the spider gears on the pins. I will set this aside for a moment. Then slide the spider gear with the shaft into the carrier. Now insert the spider gears with the pin. Then the other spider gear with the shaft, making sure the gears mesh. And lastly the ring gear. After lining up the holes, thread all four screws into the gear. Like so. After placing the bearings, place the ring gear assembly and the pinion gear with the bearings. Then the other side of the case. Lastly, thread in two screws holding the differential case together. To mark which side the ring gear is on, the head of the screw goes on the side of the ring gear. There we have the assembled differential case. The differential case can be placed at different angles in the housing. With the differential case straight, the driveline will bind up at a steeper angle. Changing the angle of the differential, however, allows the driveline to spin at extreme angles. Well, that's all for now. Make sure to check out the rest of our helpful videos.